so what is up everybody we are uh, back out here doing some testing today and I figured I would get this part uh, over with while I'm driving by myself it's kind of odd that I'm driving by myself but we are on our way right now dad and Nick with the truck and trailer are a little bit ahead of us so we're catching up to them and uh, big P is gonna come out for a showing today and uh, we're gonna go do some testing so we have like a little list of stuff that we have to do because next week April 8th I think no April 6th I don't know which one T today is the day before Easter and the weekend after we're going to New Media or Cecil probably New Media to go test for uh, Corey Stamper's race in North Carolina so we got to make sure this car can go uh, five it should probably really should go five teens honestly in this kind of weather because the uh, index I guess even though it's a no time race that we are entering there is a 530 index uh, on that class and it's probably gonna be about 90 when we're there and it's about 50 here so we should probably be able to go into the five teens to be able to back it down obviously to 530s when we get there and we might not have to back it down because it's probably gonna be 40 degrees hotter there than it is here uh, but it's a very nice day out mm very nice day for the end of march in new york it's about 55 it should get up to about 60 today and it's kind of silly i guess if you think about it that we're going to test on the street but uh we've had some conversations with nice express and stuff like that so we got some gauges you saw i'm gonna show the clip right now of us getting our big package from nice express they sell a scale with their kit mm -hmm. extra oh damn boy Get both of them filled. Yeah, they are big. So I'll have to stitch this into the video because we're taking these bottles out literally right now to go use them. But Nitrous Express hooked us up, uh, partner this year and for the foreseeable future. Helped us out with some good pricing on some bottles. Got some 15 pound bottles. I got an extra 10 pound bottle. I got I got my kit, even though we don't really need it right now. It was, I figured let's just do it all at once. And then some shirts, hats and stuff like that and a gauge and all that stuff. I'll show you more, but we're literally taking the stuff out right now to use it right now. Right now, like I said, on our way to the test spot and uh, we're going to probably start our little list of stuff. We want to phase the rotor. Nick's got to figure out the issue with the drive shaft sensor. There's no sense in going to test without a drive shaft sensor. Uh, nowadays, at least, I guess. So we're gonna figure that out. We gotta phase the rotor. Dad's got a flow gauge ready that we purchased from Nitrous Express because we think we might, the gauge might actually be wrong on the regulator for the nitrous kit. And we might be running this thing like really, really fat. And that could be why we're not really pushing out the amount of power. Cause we put 300, we put jets in it that should give us 300 a 300 shot of nitrous and we don't know if we're necessarily even getting that we might be putting in big ass jets and just flooding it and you know only picking up maybe 50 60 horsepower from it so we got a big ass flow gauge uh, from nitrous express we're going to check that and make sure that's good and try to get a little bit more aggressive with the nitrous kit as well um it goes up to 500 obviously we don't want to run it on the ragged edge uh, to run what we need to run. We'd like to be a little bit conservative, I would assume, so we don't, you know, drive all the way to North Carolina and, you know, blow it up. But we're gonna do what we have to do. We're ready to go to Nitrous. We're ready to go to North Carolina for this race. We're gonna go test, get that already. So heading over there, should be there soon, fill some bottles, and then start testing on some nitrous on the street. Also, I guess I'll just clarify now. This test session, yes, obviously we plan on going to some no preps and some back of the track stuff, which just surface is pretty much equivalent to. It's actually getting a little bit better. But today's session is really more or less to see the difference. If we figure out the fuel situation with the nitrous, we want to see the difference and see what's going on there and try to tune some nitrous stuff. So it's not necessarily to let the, you know, set the world on fire today. We might get there and blow the tire off three times in a row. Uh, if we see a difference in the nitrous kit and how much and how aggressive it's getting, you know, that'll be a plus for us. So there's a track, a prep track event that we're testing for. So obviously this doesn't necessarily matter, 
but this is really just to test the nitrous kit and see and figure out how we actually get more aggressive with the kit that we have in it now. So, you know, before I wasn't really blowing the tire off. If today we go there with the same kit and the same prep and the same surface and we absolutely annihilate the tire, we know that, you know, we didn't make a clean pass and we didn't go 60 feet, but we definitely stepped up the game and the nitrous is definitely hitting harder than it was last year. So that's really the goal. We're not looking to obviously blow the tire off. We'd love to make a killer pass, but you know, if if there's a difference in wheel speed and all that, that would be a plus. Before I forget, we got our package here. It's like a party pack. Pop this thing open. Damn, they really wrapped this up. I like that. Hey. So I didn't show you last time. In the last video, we did the scoop. Now it's on. I'll wait on you. do is we should put this on a chain. Oh, and I'm gonna can, have a and you big can like, fucking clock. And you can like hold it like there and you put it in and you see that. <laughs> okay, so making some more progress here. I just wanna shout out Tom Gunner and Mike Pollen for helping us out on the middle of the day on Saturday. Picking up the phone and helping us out with some stuff. We gotta switch some lines over. We got uh, the lines from the regulator to the solenoid are fours. And we got advice to switch them to sixes. So that's what we're gonna do right now. Shout out to them. Thank you guys for helping us out. You ready, Nick? Yep. They say you want to be even with the. Go ahead. Five. Five. Okay. So. No, he already backed it off your head. Go ahead. Back it off. What? All right, you backed it off for half a turn. What a go to. Didn't do shit. Yeah, it didn't do shit. Back it off another. Go ahead. Right there, I would tighten it there and be Lock done. Lock it up. Prop me up beside the jukebox if I die. Lord, I want to go to heaven, but I don't want to go tonight. Fill my boots up with sand, put a stiff drink in my hand. Prop me up okay. beside out here. Everything seems to be good. like a pro my team that bitch rolled I thought so well you definitely tell it was nitrous yeah I don't think he has anything at the head but when he got out he's got it in Nick how did it feel Shit. It looked fast as it, shit. It, it I don't care sounded, what the drag he said. Yeah, it sounded fast. It yeah. went. Um, the drag was one. Uh, that's about where we were that one yeah. last year. Yeah, yeah. Hmm, a little wet there. You know what? That little wet might be oil from pulling it out. Did you do you have other ones or do you? Yeah, we, I have the old ones, but the old ones are a different. Uh, yeah. So listen, why don't we put two old ones in? 
it's go sure, back and I want your father and Eddie to look at them. Eddie to look at them. It definitely spun at the hit, and I probably shouldn't have stayed in it, but. All right. A little suspension tunage here for my boy Nick. Loosening up five clicks on the compression. I think we gotta delay it again. Okay. Get you out of the hole. We gotta get you rolling. Yeah, we gotta get you out. Do the same as the first pass. What about the point front three? end was hiked up like mad. What about point three, but less when it comes in, but then bring it in hard. Point three, 75 horsepower. 
Yeah, like tw uh, that was thirty percent. So we'll do twenty percent. Twenty percent. Do it. for tonight I'm on my way home I'm gonna meet my dad home and Nick load up the car and uh, not load up the car what am I talking about back the truck and trailer up into the driveway uh, I'd say overall successful still kind of at the same numbers between 60 foot and stuff like that so not much progress on that end but you never know it's not really a good road that might honestly be all that road can take we don't really know so because we've only really tested on that road so um, we'll see, but Nick saw a major improvement in uh, the nitrous stuff, you know, back halving and everything. He really felt it hit, so obviously we must have been a, way fatter than we thought we were uh, with the fuel for the nitrous. So we have it at 8 now, which is still fat, according to uh, Jimmy Dale, Tom Gunner, and uh, Poland. So... Uh, we're at 8 right now. We might get a little bit more aggressive next week. We'll see. Everything we did pretty much today is probably going to totally go out the window next week because we're going to a prep track. Not a radio prep, but a prep track. So that's what the uh, that's where we're going next week. So thank you guys for watching. And hopefully we'll, you know, it's looking to be a good year. It's still going to be a good year. Hopefully we get to some different roads and maybe test on some other roads around here. There's a couple of them that are pretty good. We're not very far from one of them when we test. So we'll see. But thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in the next one. shot car, hit place, bad fish take, AK slanging as gangster, white flags with the long hang, two gun gang, twin blocks, got on flame. Should have been a teacher high, but you 